For glute swimming, it's one of the ways of really firing better through this muscle because one of the things that you should be checking when you're doing something such as prone swimming is whether or not you're engaging that muscle properly and also how well you're engaging it compared between the left and the right. So I'm going to, again, be in the prone position. I'm gonna draw those hips up, draw my belly button away from the floor. I'm gonna bend my left leg to around 90 degrees. If you've got the leg a bit straighter, that's fine. And just by bending it, we're gonna be taking some tension out of the hamstring. You'll still work the hamstring, but you're gonna work more through the bottom muscle. So I've got my right hand going across the back of my body onto my left glute max. And what I wanna do is I wanna engage that glute max and then lift the sole of the foot up towards the ceiling. And I'm not gonna let that leg rest on the floor. I'm gonna do six to eight of these little glute lifts. And then I'm gonna switch and do six to eight with the other. So as usual, we're keeping our alignment. So this is just a way of isolating a lot better through our gluteus maximus. And once I've done half a dozen, so I'll go back to the original leg and now I'll probably do a few more. So the first set I might do six to eight. Now I might do eight to 12. And as usual, the numbers are always just a guide. So my hand here, my left hand, is checking that I'm not rolling my pelvis. My right hand is checking not just that I'm engaging my glute max, but how well I'm engaging it. And once again, you'll notice I'm not lifting particularly high Now, if you were to go back to your prone swimming, I'd like you to probably check on your glute max and you'll notice it's so much easier to fire through it before you stretch the leg away. Breathing out as you're lifting up, breathing in as you relax down. And when you're alternating like I'm doing now, that's when you're gonna really notice the muscle switching on, switching off. If you were to go for the paddling legs, which is what I'm doing now, both of these will be working the whole time. And relax, I'm just gonna have a little child's pose stretch. And then I will show you one more variation of the prone swimming, which is our Superman's, where we add the arm and also through the crown of the head. So I'm just having my little child's pose. And so I'll be back very shortly and I will move on to our Superman's.